Hello and welcome to another Microsoft PowerPoint tutorial. In this tutorial we will going to be learning how to work with the spell check in PowerPoint. So I have this new slide with three errors as you can see that they're all highlighted in red. One way to fix the problem is I can right click on the word and I could choose whichever option I would like to choose. If I want to say spell check, I click on spell check and it fixes the problem for me. However, if I have more than one items and right clicking in each one of them could be a little cumbersome, so I can go about clicking on the review and I can click spelling. That's one way to do that. Or I could use the keyboard shortcut of F7. Or down below in the status bar, I could be clicking on this book with an X mark on it. All of these are different ways of going about running a spell check. So if I click F7, or press F7 on the keyboard, which is one of the function keys up top, now it shows me that for this word, which is selected, the correct spelling could be thesaurus. So I can say, okay, go, go, go ahead and change this spelling so that it gets changed and the error gets removed. And it says, what should I do with synonyms? And I say, well, this is the correct spelling for synonyms. Change that as well. Then it comes back and say, well, the spell check is complete and no more words to be looking at. Similarly, what I, else I can do is I can always right click on a word and check to see if that particular word has any synonyms, which are other words that mean exactly the same but could fit better within the current context. If I want to replace that with dictionary, I could just click on dictionary and the source gets replaced with dictionary. So these are some of the options that you can play around with as far as the spell check is concerned. I'll catch you in the next tutorial with some more PowerPoint features.